facing the wrong way. I'm such a numbnut. I can't wait till you can just press the button and reverse it while you're still taping. Anyway, guys, it is quarter to 11. I am showered. I'm up. I've been up since five. I've spoken to mum already. She um, called me by mistake this morning, so we chatted. Mum, this is how I'm supposed to look when we chat. At least my hair's decent. My hair had curled in so many different ways. Uh, we spoke at 8.30 this morning. It was so hot last night. I was tossing and turning and it just was like awful. But anyway, I'm sat in front of the air conditioner, but I am going downstairs now because Pete, there's some stuff on the deck he wants to work on today. So that means I am in charge of you, but giving out a girl. But I don't really want to do it today. I just wanted a day where I didn't have to think about anyone. I know that's selfish, but I've been in the house since the beginning of March. I have been out a couple of times to drop off sales, as you know, but that is it. There's been no getting together with people, no drinks, no this, no that, no nothing. And I am climbing the walls. I've had enough. I'm tired. I'm, I'm, and I'm like, um, what's the word? I don't even know. I just feel like I want some normalcy and I'm not getting it. But anyway, I'm going to go down now. I'm going to put the AC on in the living room for the third day in the row. Come on weather. It's too early to be so humid. Um, but I am going to go down now and just watch some TV down there. Keep an eye on Luna. I made the mistake of leaving the bathroom door open downstairs because our Louis used to love to go in there and lay on the tiles because he felt it was cooler. Well, I thought, well, I'll leave it open. Luna will be fine. I went in there to go to the loo and Luna had decided that she would take the whole roll of toilet paper and shred it. And I totally forgot that she does that because I have not been the one to clean it up before Ashley has. So yeah. So we're down, <laughs> toilet paper down, um, naughty dog. But anyway, that is that for now. I need to go have some water or something nice and cold. And I will definitely talk to you guys in a little while. I hope you have a wonderful weekend. And um, wherever you are, did I go a bit dark on the, tell me guys, did I go too dark on the eyeshadow? I shall go what eyeshadow, but it's a bit darker than normal. I used a different thing changed it up i don't wear a lot so when i it's because i'm like focusing on it it's not too bad it's a uh, one of the um oh what is it my favorite thing soap and glory palettes anyway guys i think we're going to uh go and start using the camera again to vlog i want to see the difference again see if i can because i feel like i got this camera a year ago and then i got the new phone and i never bothered with the camera so we need to give this camera a chance so that's what i'm going to do hopefully i will not lose any <laughs> any um clips or anything like that but my order came from Tasty simple i don't know if you can see it on the kitchen table probably not but all my key lime stuff has come in so i'm going to make a key lime dip to go and i got the little pretzels that they sell the uh things i'll show you after anyway because i don't want to get up again i uh, forgot to get my medication when i was upstairs so i'm just going to sit here and behave myself and uh i've got the ac on over there it's trying to call me off it's trying its hardest it's the little engine that think it could this is the one that we've had now for 30 32 years so it's still doing quite well anyway we've got the real housewives of orange county on the tv old old episodes but they recorded the other day so i'm going to watch them and dibble dabble down here oh he did it i didn't even notice he put most of the stuff back in the office good that's what i wanted so i can vacuum down here later i'm not doing it now it's way too hot and i'm clean and i smell nice right now so we'll, we'll save that for when i'm not not doing too good he has just left he's going over to home depot to get some wood to do the railings on the deck so at least then the deck will be able to be sat on i think i was getting a bit confused how he's explaining how he's doing things i get a bit frustrated because i'm like that's gonna look weird that's gonna look weird and he's like no and then he, he knows in his mind how it's gonna look he goes when have i ever made anything that's looked strange and you have no fit i said no i said you need to watch all my vlogs because i have never once said pete can't do home fixings i don't even know what home diy stuff because i've always admired the amount of stuff he can put his mind to and how much stuff he does so it was nothing to do with that it's just in my mind when he's trying to explain something to me 
I was hearing something completely different and he was getting a bit frustrated and I'm not, so then I get frustrated because I'm bored in the house, house in the board. Um, but I've never said he, he can't put his mind to something and then do it and it looks fabulous afterwards. He recited the whole front of the house for crying out loud. He's not a contractor. He did, he put brand new stairs on the back of the deck. He built things in here. He's, he's fixed so much stuff. He's done the flooring. I've never said he can't do anything. So I said, no, you, now you need to go back and watch eight years worth of vlogs so you can see what I say about your home do-it-yourself stuff. Right, Luna? I've never complained. Why are you crying? He's gone to get stuff. He'll be back. <laughs> anyway, um, the thing is, if he does do that this weekend, then I can sit out there next week because I think, hey, Google, what's the weather for the week? It'll be mostly sunny there tomorrow, with a high of 76 and a low of 58. Ooh, it's going to be nice tomorrow. Hey, Google, what's the weather on Monday? It'll be sunny there Monday, with a high of 79 and a low of 61. Luna, what you doing up there? Luna? Pete's gone now, so she's miserable. Do I abuse you? Is that why? You must be with Pete. I said to Pete, the way she acts... Like when they come home, it's almost like, Sue's been mean to me all day long. She's so mean. <laughs> Which I'm clearly not. I just said to Pete, I need a Roxy dog. I'm still really heartbroken. He's like, I know. I'm like, take that in, no, because I don't want you just to blow me out when I say one day, I need a Roxy dog and I'm getting one. I will literally come over. I said, someone needs to have puppies around here so I can have one. I need a little doggy. I miss Roxy so much. It's sad. Oh dear, oh dear. Everyone, it is now quarter to four. No, it's not, it's quarter to three. Um, the lad that was gonna come at two o'clock did come and pick up his yearbook. Luna's down on the ground here. Pete is working on the back deck. He didn't get back until about two o'clock. He's been running around like a crazy person. Poor thing, I said, when you're out, do you mind just getting some chicken salad from the deli, seeing as you're out? I said, and some potato salad to go with the steak for dinner tonight. He's like, no problem. I said, don't get uh, pasta salad because I'm going to make it. So he comes back with chicken salad, which was fantastic, a small pasta salad and no potato salad. And he was going back out again. And I go, um, you forgot something. He goes, what? <laughs> The potato salad, I said no pasta salad. <laughs> if you know anything about Pete, <sighs> the biggest sigh, like deflation. I'm like, don't worry about it. We'll do something, you know, we'll have the pasta salad and then I'll just do tomatoes and cucumbers, whatever. So he goes out, goes to Home Depot, buys all the wood he needs, goes to his brother's, borrows the tools he needs, comes back, here's your potato salad. He went back. I said, did they say anything to you in the deli? He goes, no, but the girl was on the phone and she did look at me like, weren't you just here? So I now have, I don't have to make any, well, I, I'm still going to chop up some tomato and cucumber if the cucumber's still good. I was trying to get an order. I thought, well, I'll just order some potato salad online because I need like five other things, but I can't get any deliveries till tomorrow anyway, so I'm not bothering. So he's hammering away outside. It is hot out there. Look at my face. Well, don't. It's hot outside. Uh, I took Luna out and she got caught up on the lead and of course now it's ripped halfway. I'm like, we can't, I can't win for losing taking this dog outside. Something happened, so I might have to get her a new lead now. Anyway, that's where we're at. I'm about to have some chicken salad and some little crackers for lunch because that's all I want. I haven't had anything since eight, 7 o'clock when I had my cereal. What was that, 6.30? No, that was 6.30. Uh, I'm quite peckish now and I don't think anyone else is coming. Like I said, we've moved all the stuff back into the office and I'll just take the stuff that's here into there as well. And that way if anyone comes, I'll just bring it out on days. But I just want to tidy up. Quarter to seven. Ash is home. <laughs> Poor Ash, she's home now. She's a bit stressed because she's got homework to do and she's hot and she's not feeling the greatest because not only do they have the masks, but when they're up at the register, they have to put these 
those other shield protectors over the head. And it is a hot one today. It's ah, him just at the wrong time. Sorry, guys. But um, yeah, just at the wrong time. But feeling a bit nauseous and headachey all day is, is a lot from this heat. Especially when you're on your feet, regardless. Even when you're in air conditioning, you get used to it after a while, don't you? You don't feel like you're under any. But uh, my room's reading 84. It was 86 when I just came up, but I'm going to sit up here. Pete will not come in. Keep trying him to get him to come in. I'm like, tomorrow's another day, but no. He's out there, and literally all as he's had today is a cup of coffee and two bottles of water. He, I said to him, stop and that. Ages ago, I'm like, stop, I'll make you some No, don't want anything. So I just said to him before, come in. You know, this can be finished tomorrow. It doesn't have to be done tight. No, I want to carry on. But, guys, if you know Pete, you know this is him and he won't stop. Anyway, I am stopping. <laughs> I'm going to let him leave you for a bit and I'll talk to you in a while. In a while. It's breezy now, guys. Cloud in the sky. Hope he's cleaning up. He needs a break. Oh, it feels nice out. Where is he? Oh, there he is. You still alive? Yeah. No, I'm good. Break yourself. How do you do that? Ah, silly sod. Anyway, Pete's been working on the deck as you can see. Gonna put the railing, the things up tomorrow. And then we can start being outside instead of cooped up inside. Yeah. Guys, it is dinner, but trouble is the cucumbers look funny because they were frozen in the fridge. But looks good. Luna, are you a koala? She's like, yes, yes, I am. Hello everyone, 5 past 11, I'm going to end the vlog here. We were watching, we watched while we were eating, um, Pitch Perfect was on the first one, which is my favourite of the three. And then, um, what's the name came on? Hangover. And I've never watched The Hangover all the way through. And I just said to Ash, how long is this on for? She said till 12, I can't do another hour. <laughs> so I've come up here, she's gone to bed too. She's taken Luna up, she's going to watch TV, she's having a beer. Um, she just did a whole bunch of homework. She's been doing homework for the last few hours. Pete is all cramped up. He cu he couldn't move his fingers. He was eating dinner and his hands all cramped up. And then his legs, which is from working so much outside. And I think all as he's had today before dinner was a cup of coffee and two bottled waters, which is not enough. Kept telling him to stop, stop, relax, come in, sit down, have lunch. No. If you know Pete, you know there's no stopping him once he starts. He's like, I'm fine. But he wasn't fine tonight, he was in pain. So, um, he's doing better now. I gave him some of that Avon Aspira because uh, it's got electrolytes in it and stuff like that. So, yep, because he did a lot of cutting and measuring and hammering and nailing and all sorts. He's just got to put the slats in tomorrow. Um, so yeah, it's taking shape and he's going to build a, a gate so that way uh, Luna can't go down off the deck. So if the back door opens, it'll be fine because Luna can at least go walk on the back deck, you know, without getting out. But anyway, guys, on that note, I'm going to love and leave you for this evening. I hope everyone had a brilliant, brilliant Saturday, whatever it is you did today. I hope it was a good one and we will definitely see you tomorrow. Stay safe, everyone.